So today we're going to install templates and there's two different ways people give you templates for Scrivener. The first way is when it's a Scriv template file and we'll also do one that's just a Scrivener document and intended to be a template. You're going to file new project or if it's already open you have your project templates here. Click options, import templates, the enhanced, there it is. Find it in your document picker, import, and there it is. If you want to start your own document using it, click on it and click choose. You have to name the file, test, short story, create. And there's the short story template. To do this academic paper template, which is a dot scriv, that's an actual Scrivener document. So you have to actually open it first. And in this case, update it to the latest Scrivener. And here it is. Okay, this is their, they've got their things selected here. What do I want to select? Um, let's say we want to start with our introduction for the draft of our academic paper. Give us an idea of where, where it's going to open. And, and this can be done with any document you create. So this is how to make a template. So when you have a document and you want to make it into a template, go to File, Save as Template. You have to choose which category you want. In this case, for academic papers, I want nonfiction. Academic paper from web. I found this somewhere. Academic with icon. And I'm going to save it. So I say OK. Now, when I close this document, if I want to start an academic paper, I go to New Project, Nonfiction, and the one from the web is there. So I would select that one, hit Choose, and it'll make a whole new document. I name it. The template won't change when I save my document, but my document borrows everything from the template first. So now you know how to import templates from around the web or templates that you get from me, whether they are already set up as Scriv template or if they're an actual Scrivener document that's meant to be a template. Please like this video. And if you look down in the notes, you'll see that I have a link to my Fiverr account where I have a Snowflake template, I have a Udemy course creation template, and the newest one is a nonfiction book proposal template. All of my templates are made as walkthroughs. They don't just leave you on a blank page to write things, they ask you questions and help guide you through the process. So I'll talk to you later.